Squeechu, here. Mudkipper, here. Flynn, here. It's up to us to do this Friday video we've been planning. Okay. Planet Dolan. Illustrated by Spinal Palm. Doopy? Indeed, Doopy. Yeah. Hey there, my name is Melissa. I'll be Wait. looking at the questions and answers. And I've been... It's my turn. It's <laughs> doopy time. Now doopy in the building. Now I'm reading out the other stuff. Me. Yay. Hurrah. Ravenwolf 14 asks, if all of human life went extinct, what would be the last remaining evidence that we existed? My guns. The last remaining evidence one's, of life would be... One's found. helmet. My outfit what? can definitely stand the test of time. Check it. Pearls. These will never go out of style. White is always... Black's also in it as well. Good to add these with whatever you put on. What about my outfit, Doopy? Mm. Do you think it's timeless? Um. Oh yeah. I'll make my. Yeah, Ever. Cool. Hey guys, on the toilet, vomiting. Cute. Wait for me. Super cute. Uh, I can't even. I don't even want to answer. Great wall of China. Um. To be clearly honest, I, I, I enjoy it. What about you guys? Blah. Ill. Mud kipper. I'm sorry. Space junk is likely to stick around the longest. No. Oh. This orbital debris will circle Ugh, the Earth. Feel like queasier. Flynn. Devin, four, five, what? Nine, Don't die. <laughs> I'll be bad. How are cats able to walk so uh, I got a bob. Other animals cannot. Cats are very sneaky. They're shifty. They don't make much sound when they walk around. <gasps> what was that? I don't know that's uh, the blue racer. Well, Speedy Gonzales or the Roadrunner. Cats are light and graceful with each step. And what the... Uh, there they go again. <laughs> Yes, indeed I did. Am I just... Nope. Uh, never mind. Cats move in a much oh, hi, Shima. more efficient way than other species. When we walk, each step helps propel us into the next using our hip joints. Cats, on the other hand, use movements that essentially cancel each other out, keeping their body weight even so their movements don't give them away. This is how... Oh, so that was who was running like that. Hi, Shima. Again. Why do flies like things that smell bad? Ew, flies are so gross. Hey, we resent that. I have a friend who is a fly. Things. They're always flying around the nastiest things. You know, like helmet. Yeah, well, maybe some of us don't enjoy smelling like fruits and flowers. Yuck. Here, try this new lavender papaya infusion what? spray. It's all natural and helps bring out the fine undertones in your Oh! Oh, directly in the eye pocket. <laughs> I'm sorry for you, dude. Place for female flies to lay their eggs. Ooh. Rotting food is damp and moist, and when the eggs hatch, the larvae can feed on the food. No, no, no. Although the rotting food would make us sick, and the repellent scent to flies, it likely still contains nutrients. Yeah. Savas made asks, what was the first football game ever recorded? Hmm. Well, Dolan says that people call soccer football in other places in the world. Yeah, like USA. I See, uh, someone else agrees with me on this opinion. Doopy. Dude, Can you're an ass, so you're upset. Oh, no, 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 no. You need to try again. Don't try to it's convince really me. If I always if I said it once, I'll say it's it again. Amazing. I hate sports. I hate soccer. soccer. Or, like, the, the outfits, the team colors everyone wears. Not working. Or, uh, yeah, uh, no, I mean, I'll take your word on it. Or yeah, I won't try to take yours on it, though. Here, look at this. This is the one I wore back on my days on the team. Oh what boy. Help. Uh, if I said it once, I'll say it again. Uh, dude, don't say it again, Mud Kipper. I will not play sports. No one will make me try this thing again. Again, because I already got used as a football once. That was squeeze you, dude. You got used like a baseball once. Oh. What's the difference? Oh, headphones are a great way to brighten up your day. Workouts, looks. Practices. Art. Yeah. I use them all the time. I have a pair with cat ears on them. Mm. Ooh, doopy. What kind of music are you into? Those old school jams? Mm. Or do you crunk out to that techno beat? Huh? That mm. Mm. Question marks. Boom, boom, pow stuff. Imagine if we actually made this video and every time they say see boom more pow something blows up. Yeah, imagine that. Us getting blown to pieces. We'd be dead in an instant.
This turns the coil into an electromagnet, moving the magnet back and forth at different speeds and distances. This magnet then vibrates a cone, which sends the signals out into the air. It works similarly to a drum that vibrates when struck, moving the air in front of it. Goldsman yeah. Elner asks, what would the world be like if we arrived Goldsman in the world would look E-R. so fabulous. Uh, Everyone would be beautiful and pristine, no uggles or yeah. side faces. No smelly demons either. Ah, uh, it would be a dream come true. I can already imagine it. Scientists, get on that. Never. Before all disease was eradicated. Those associated with the treatment of illness would lose their jobs. See, they be as badness to this. Nurses and pharmaceutical workers. Apart from job loss, it would also put an immense strain on the population, especially already overpopulated cities around the world. However, disease eradication could help lift people out of poverty in areas that are particularly affected, such as Africa. I just love Africa. Mainly their minds. What would life be now if we lost World War II? If we all just stopped, like, fighting yeah. and killing each other, we'd Wait, stop wasting our time building tanks and boats, and we could make way better technology huh? and more things we could actually use. Maybe instead Wait. of a shrapnel firing cannon or gun, we make something that shoots streamers. I'm sorry. What? Papers, Because it's crappy. That, that, that's just my answer. I can't really say anything else. The USA might have become isolated from Europe and the rest of Asia. Oh. Germany would be the largest power in Europe with the largest borders. Germany, the German man. Empire would have taken control of other parts of Asia Pacific and Oceania. Yeah. Even part of America. Oh. Civil wars would likely be fought throughout Europe, and when Hitler eventually died, there would be a power struggle. The Vietnam and Korean Wars would not have occurred. Ah. Uh. Oh, what? That's horrible. Just focus on the flower cannons. Much less violent. Well, yeah. Never. World War II was pretty bad. Wait, Doopy, but what would be the point of a flower cannon? Yeah, why? Flower power. Right. right. What Rosetta girl asks, how do you mix DNA to create a new species? Hmm. Well, I wouldn't call myself much of a DNA science person. No one calls myself a bio you know, biology like whiz. That have gone through some stuff involving that. Melissa, nobody really told me exactly what happened to you. Yeah. Would you be comfortable talking about that? Um, you know, maybe just go ask Dolan about it? Sorry. Um, oh, okay. Sure thing. I'll give you some space. You do your thing. It is almost impossible to... The oh, my God! Ew! However, scientists do introduce human genes Lab experiments. This you mean rats? That That's a rat. That it's not a mouse. Get your work. No rat. Ew. Hi, Dolan. Bird. Yeah, explain. Uh, uh, oh, no. So there's, only, there's gonna be a train after this. Go ask Dolan. Uh, uh, Yo, dudes, check out this sweet trick. Oh, come on! Did you find out what you were looking for? Definitely. Kind of got no, sidetracked. Thanks to Pring. While your nose is plugged. While your nose is plugged? Mm. Uh, I don't know. I don't have much trouble with that, actually. It just sounds a bit muffled, like I'm underwater or something. I wonder if someone underwater could do it. Your answer. Apparently, Gooby can. See? Wait, squeak at you. You can do that. Yeah. Did it with Flynn. Man, I wish I had a nose. Soap. No, not soap. No, you wouldn't dare do. Just got that nasty spray out of my eyes. You're not about to. No, stop. Ah! What? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Bev time helmet. Yeah. Dude, where jackasses are we? Dude. This soap dates back to 2800 BC and was made from boiled fats and ashes. Oop. Oh. Most early soaps were made using similar methods. Huh? The ancient Roman legend states that they discovered soap when rain would wash animal fat from Mount Sapo into the Tiber River, and clothes would be easier to clean in certain parts of the water. Oh, oh my gosh, hellbent! Hi, Nixium. Ravishing, like a bouquet of adorable flowers. Oh, it, it. I'm a little turned on right now. Oh no. Nixium. Character on this entire channel. Nope, you are. Um, Mud Kipper, are you okay? Nope. Ah. Where's the toilets? Ah. You want to do the outro? Sure. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you have a video request, please post it in the comment section down below. Happy Friday, everyone. Uh, please end the video now, Thomas. I think I have to puke. Okay. Bye bye, guys.